Good morning, everybody, and welcome to today's devotion for July 5th. Today's devotion is titled Renewed Strength. The Bible reading is from Psalm chapter 103, verses 1 to 5. Praise the Lord, my soul, all my inmost being. Praise his holy name. Praise the Lord, my soul, and forget not all his benefits, who forgives all your sins and heals all your diseases, who redeems your life from the pit and crowns you with love and compassion, who satisfies your desires with good things so that your youth is renewed like the eagles. Psychiatrist Robert Coles once noticed a pattern in those who burn out while serving others. The first warning sign is weariness. Next comes cynicism about things ever improving. Then bitterness, despair, depression, and finally burnout. After writing a book about recovering from broken dreams, I once entered a busy season of conference speaking. Helping people find hope after disappointment was richly rewarding, but came at a cost. One day, about to step on stage, I thought I was going to faint. I hadn't slept well. A vacation hadn't fixed my weariness, and the thought of hearing another person's problems afterward filled me with dread. I was following Cole's pattern. Scripture gives two strategies for beating burnout. In Isaiah chapter 40, the weary soul is renewed when it hopes in the Lord. I needed to rest in God, trusting him to work, rather than pushing on in my own dwindling strength. And Psalm chapter 103 says God renews us by satisfying our desires with good things. While this includes forgiveness and redemption, provisions of joy and play come from him too. When I reworked my schedule to include more prayer, rest, and hobbies like photography, I began to feel healthy again. Burnout begins with weariness. Let's stop it from going further. We serve others best when our lives include both worship and rest. What burdens do you need to offload to God right now? How are you renewing your strength through prayer, scripture, and healthy play? Thank you for joining me for today's devotion, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.